What's up, everyone? Brad Barai Guy here. Um, <clears throat> so, George St. Pierre is set to make his UFC return against Michael Bisbing, UFC 217, November 4th. Um, GSP, the former welterweight champ, former pound for pound best, uh, nine straight title defenses, um, a welterweight. He's one of the greats. Um, He's Canadian. He was a big draw when he was in the UFC before he retired in 2013. At the time, he was one of the biggest draws in the UFC history. Still is one of the biggest draws at the time, though he was probably the biggest. He left the sport in 2013. He, I think he said he left because of steroids. Um, he knew the sport was lived with it so he decided to step away he had some things going on in his personal life so he decided to step away for that as well he's set to make his return after four years um so the big question is, is he a big star as he once was um i think he is a big star still you know he still has a name to him but he's not as big as he was in 2013 there's a lot of new people to the sport. A lot of young guys that maybe not know who George St. Pierre is. A lot of the old school guys know who he is and want to see him fight. Um, I personally want to see him fight. I think he's one. Of the, I think he's one of the greatest. He's my hero. Um, he's the reason why I got into MMA. The reason why I, I wear Under Armour. He's the reason why I work out. He's you know, he's my prototype for what an athlete is. Um, you know, I live my life vicariously through him. Same with Donald Cerrone as well. Uh, but George St. Pierre, in my mind, is still a big star. But I don't think he has, he is as big as he was in 2013. And I think they're going to be surprised with this 217 pay-per-view. It may crack a million, this pay-per-view, if they promote it white, right. Because Cody and TJ are on this fight, on that fight uh, card. So those two going at it will be great too. Um, I just don't think George is as big as he was. It's been, been a long time since he stepped out of the octagon. We haven't really heard much from him in the last four years. You know, so it's going to be interesting to see when he comes back uh, how well fans, uh, the reputation he gets, um, fan, fan reception he gets. Um, it'll be interesting how the pay-per-view goes out. Uh, they promote this fight well enough. This pay-per-view could do really good. We'll just have to see... Um, you know, I know George left on bad terms with the UFC, bad terms with the fans. A lot of people felt that he's a boring fighter, that he lays and prays. But I think George is a great fighter. I think there's something said to be beaten up for 25 minutes. There's something, you know, amazing about a guy who just grapple you for 25 minutes and beat the crap out of you. And then, you know, George did go for submissions. You know, he watches fights, he does go for submissions. Um, he's just a lot of his attack. A lot of his game planning is to be on top of you and beat the crap out of you. And, you know, that's just, it's not a fun style to watch, but it's a style that's effective and it got him to nine title defenses. So you have to give credit where credit's due and you have to, you know, look at the big picture and be like, okay, well, he is something. He has some talent if he's able to do nine straight title defenses. He went on this streak of like 40 something consecutive rounds of winning. Like, never just not losing a round. 30 uh, something, actually. I think he lost a round against Carlos Condit, round three, UFC 154. That's, you know, and then didn't win, lose a round against Diaz, and then probably lost some rounds against Hendricks. You know, he went on this incredible streak of defenses. Just, he looked unbeatable. Um, that's why it made him a big star. But like I said, I don't think he is as big a star as he once was. Um, he stepped away, you know, it's been a few years he's been away from the game, so. We'll have to see what happens uh, November 4th. So, yeah, that's my video. Let me know what you guys think. If you think he's a big star or is as big as he was when he left or is he bigger, what? You know, let me know what you think. Um, George St. Pierre, Bisping, UFC 217, November 4th. Bye-bye, guy.